Quickly on KDKA, court administrators are investigating a social media post on Facebook that shows a magistrate telling a Forest Hills police officer to shoot a suspect. And tonight, an apology over that incident. Brenda Waters joins us live in Forest Hills with the very latest. Brenda. Hi, David. That apology came in about uh, about 30 minutes ago, and this is what led to the apology from the district justice in the court behind me. George Justice, a.k.a. Bounty Hunter, posted on Facebook the video you're about to see. Sources tell us George Justice is well known to police in Forest Hills and apparently had been asked to leave the court of magistrate George Caulfield several times. Forest Hills police officer Heck is heard asking Caulfield what he should do about George Justice. The officer is wearing his body camera. I want to see how you want to perceive this event in the future. See, so in, my, in my world, you know, if you're in a private residence, it's easy. You'll convey that he's to leave. He's not welcome here. He's not here in business. And then we actually communicate it. And then it usually doesn't trespass. happen, but it usually starts to move into that defiant thing, you know, right. defiant section of criminal trespass. That's how I perceive it when it starts to become like this foolishness. Mm -hmm. so I don't know how you think of it here. In the video, the magistrate tells the officer twice to shoot George Justice. In a statement this afternoon, Magistrate Caulfield says, quote, I would like to acknowledge that the statements I made in the video were inappropriate. It was certainly not my intention for these statements to be taken seriously, and I deeply regret any harm that this has caused, end of quote. I'm told Justice was able to gain access to the officer's body cam video through the district attorney's office. Now, although the district uh, offices are over, they over, they're overseen by the Allegheny County Courts, but the courts do not discipline any of the magistrates. That is done by the Judiciary Disciplinary Board. We don't know if the magistrate here will be disciplined or not. We're waiting to get word on that. Reporting live in Forest Hills, Brenda Waters, KDKA TV News.